Hi, my name's Jeff Hutchings, and this is how to create a bass beat in BandLab. On the track Mixer screen, tap the plus icon. On the pop-up menu, tap MIDI instruments. At the top of the screen, tap on the Bases tab. Tap on a bass guitar to install it. Then tap on it again. At the bottom right of the screen, tap on the Step Sequencer icon. The two things you want to understand now is the lowest note on the bass guitar is commonly E. And to turn a note into a chord, add a second note four squares higher and a third note seven squares higher. This is known as a major chord. For the purposes of this tutorial, we will use this major chord, but sometimes you will need to use a minor chord if another instrument is playing a minor chord. To turn a note into a minor chord, add a second note three squares higher and a third note seven squares higher. Here we have a song with a keyboard playing the major chord G. So let's add a simple bass beat using the chord's bass note, G. Now this works with some types of music, but let's make it more interesting. And we can do that by using the chord notes. So first we can move any of the bass notes four squares higher. To make the bass beat even more interesting, we can move any of the notes seven squares higher. We can now use this bass beat whenever the other instruments are playing a G note or a G major chord. If the keyboard now changes chord, to the D major chord, we can simply do the same again, adding D notes, then moving any of the D notes either four notes higher or seven notes higher. And to create even more interesting bass beats, try removing some of the notes. Or make some of the notes longer. If you've enjoyed this video, do give us a thumbs up and click on that subscribe button. Cheers.